Yo, this is the L7C here, bringing you know, another Yu-Gi-Oh! duel. You already know how we do. Let's hop into this game right now. Hand. Eh, it's it's alright. We got Tenny Spirit, Apprentice, Two Faithful Servants, and Imperm. So, it's not bad. Always could be better. Your hands always could be better when you get selfish. But we're going to see what happens over here. We see a trade-in. So obviously we're assuming dragons because they have the most level 8s. Dragon Spirit of White. So if you're playing Dragon Spirit of White, you got to be playing Blue Eyes. So it looks like we're playing against a Blue Eyes deck. Dragon Shrine. Probably going to dump the original Blue Eyes. Oh, dump the White Stone to get Blue Eyes to hand. Okay. So we're playing a Blue Eyes deck. You know how we love playing against Blue Eyes decks and Dark Magician decks since our deck's a mixture of the two. So let's see how we do. Let's see this guy's style of blue eyes. So we're waiting. If he added the blue eyes to hand, we're assuming he's going to summon an alternative. Assuming. So then he'll reveal blue eyes, special summon alternative. Maybe summon one of the tuners. Oh, he sets. Looks like this guy's different, which I like. I like different. So let's see what this guy does after his set and... Oh. We were right. We're right so far. So he's revealing blue eyes. That means he's special summoning alternative. Mm-hmm. Is asking if we want to activate Imperm. There'd be no point of activating Imperm. And he ends. We're like, okay. Drew a dark renewal. That's cool. So first thing we activate. Special summon Tenny Spirit. Then we're going to set Imperm. And we're looking. Then we're gonna do apprentice. Get rid of the one of the faithful servants. Special summon her. Activate the effect. To add dark magician to hand. We're gonna set. Then we're gonna activate the faithful servant. Put magician souls up top. And turn. Reason we put Magician Souls up top, hoping we survive so that we dump Dark Magician Girl. We get special summon a Dark Magician. That's the goal, so that we could draw two. But that is the goal right now. We even could have, since we special summoned both, we could have attributed for Dark Magician, but that just wasn't the move at the point in time. So let's see what he does here. And we're waiting. Does alternatives affect? Which that's that's fine. To pop a monster on the field. We wanna keep Apprentice alive just in case he summons a monster so we can dark renewal. So he picked any spirit. Which is cool. I actually don't think I should have impermed here. I think that was a bad imperm on my part, but I get to keep my monster. So now we're waiting to see what else the blue eyes player does. And we're waiting. I'm waiting for him to summon something. Because we know he has to summon something. So what are you going to summon? This is the thing, too. We're just sitting here waiting for a little bit. So, you know, as always, when we're waiting for a bit, make sure you subscribe. If you're into these Yu-Gi-Oh! duels, oh, now he plays his Dragon Shrine, but since because of Imperm, it got negated. Don't know why he set Dragon Shrine, but he might have had a strategy that I wasn't seeing ahead into yet. So now we are waiting again. He plays Melody of the Awakening Dragon. Which is cool, which is cool. He'll discard a card, get to add two big dragons to his hand. We're waiting to activate that Dark Renewal. That's the thing. We're waiting to tribute at the right time. So he discarded the original Blue Eyes that he got with White Stone of Legend. And he just ends. 
So that didn't go the way I thought it would. But honestly, I can't kill his monster. So we're going to activate. We're going to special summon Dark Magician Girl. And we're going to go into battle. We're going to attack with Dark Magician Girl. One thing could be Che. We're going to do Apprentice. Get extra 2k to blow her up. To kill what alternative? So now we got Dark Magician and Tenny. Got some faithful servants in the grave. And we still have the Dark Renewal. So Dark Renewal is still alive. That's the point. So he's doing Melody again. Discarding the polymerization. Ooh. So now he has another alternative. You would have think he would have been able to fusion summon into something if he had the poly in hand, but to each their own. So he revealed blue eyes, so he's going to summon alternative. That's our cue to activate dark renewal, to target alternative, send us both to grave so that we could special summon a spellcaster. We go for magician of dark illusion, the fake dark magician. And now we're waiting for opponent. So they obviously have something they can activate here. And they just go to end phase. We draw Rainbow Karibo. We reposition our fake Dark Magician attack. We actually, we do one of the Faithful Servants because he counts as Dark Magician on the field so that we get two draws. We draw in the circle. We get to rearrange the deck. And then we attack. And then we also end turn. I believe uh, we tribute right here to have the original Dark Magician on field just to have the Tenny and get him out of our hand. So we got Dark Magician and Circle by themselves. Oh, we got a Rainbow Karibo in the hand, so it's not by themselves. Against a Blue Eyes deck, as always, isn't this fitting? We'll see if the Blue Eyes portion of my deck comes to the party or if the Dark Magician deck saw that. I was like, eh, we're going against Blue Eyes, so we're going to show our... We're going to go straight show mode. And then just ends his turn there. Whitestone goes off. So then he gets blue eyes, white dragon. So there you got a dark magician versus blue eyes, white dragon. Face to face. Dark magician isn't strong enough to take out blue eyes right now. So we're going to have to end. So we got the Yugi Kaiba thing right now. You can't. Dark Magician can never just kill Blue Eyes straight up. You gotta, you gotta strategize. So he's getting his alternative back, which is fine. So we're waiting to see what he's gonna do there. We're waiting to see what he is gonna do. I would assume that he would, yep, reveal special summon alternative again. So now we got a blue eyes and a blue eyes alternative. He's going to pop Dark Magician, which there's nothing we can do about that. But then we activate Tenny Spirits Effect. That's why I love this card so much. We bring back the Dark Magician, destroy a monster, and we get circles. We get to banish a monster. So from him destroying our Dark Magician... We got to get rid of two of his dragons. One banished, one destroyed. That is why Tenny Spirit, if you're running a DM deck or a Blue Eyes deck, or any deck that their ace monsters are normal monsters, look out for these Tennies. You can really integrate them with your deck. So then we draw Apprentice, which is cool. We still don't have enough. We have 4,900. So we could... We're going to activate it again. Get the two draws. Which, which isn't bad, because now we get to toss the blue eyes. Summon Apprentice. Summon Sage. Do Sage's effect. He's probably like, Sage? I was like, yeah, bro, I run Dark Magicians and Blue Eyes combined. That's why it's the main deck. Go into Link Karibo. 
and we just we were curious about that face down. If we would have kept Apprentice in attack mode, we would have won. But it was what it was. Actually, we wouldn't have won. We would have a hundred. We'd be a hundred short. So it was what it was. So then we go Lincoln into the BLS, and then end turn. So now we got a BLS out here. We we're, we're in good shape right now. Our eight, we're, we have the life point advantage, monster advantage. We have two hand traps in hand, Rainbow Karibo and Effect Baylor. So we're going to see. But he has a lot of dragons. He might just pull out a dragon's mirror and summon like five-headed dragon. Or a blue eyes ultimate. Summons white stone of legend. So I see if we want to activate anything. I'm like, no, there's nothing we want to activate. Tributes. For his own Link Karibo, so then he gets to add the blue eyes, which is fine. We still have a Wabaku down there too that prevent our monsters from being destroyed by battle and taking no damage. So we're in a good we're in a good spot. We're waiting to see what this guy does. He summoned two alternatives for this game. One of his blue eyes is his banished. Ask if we're not doing anything. No. So end turn. We draw Keeper of Dragon Magic. So this this is <laughs> this is kind of cool right here. We do Keeper of Dragon Magic, do his effect, get rid of the circle. I see if we activate anything. We get Fusion Deployment, activate Fusion Deployment. We get a Blue Eyes White Dragon. Then we activate Keeper of Dragon Magic's effect to bring back a fusion material. We bring back the other Blue Eyes White Dragon. Then we go into the extra deck to get another one of our favorite extra deck monsters. Blue Eyes Twin Burst. Blue Eyes, first we attack with Keeper. He has to make it zero. And it's actually no. And then we replay the battle, no. Then we win with the twin burst to the face, showing the blue eyes side to kill a blue eyes player.